is a very exciting day in Tarmina. We have arrived yesterday. We took a hotel uh, transfer car to get us from the airport to this location here in Tarmina, which was about a 50 minute drive. Um, we saw Mount Etna, we saw all the beautiful towns last night. There's a cable car that rides for 10 euros that takes you from the bottom here all the way up to the town, um, which was so busy. Tons of restaurants, tons of shops, beautiful scenic views. Um, so that's what we did when we arrived yesterday and I'm starting my vlog from today. Um, initially when I arrived at this location I was like what is this it's a little old school looking but the place is actually growing on me because we're right now here for breakfast and it's literally a super long line of like just food that goes on forever I'll obviously show you um, they got an omelet I got a crepe with like Nutella and strawberries because mmm and the views here are really nice um, I'll show you around here look so this is the sea facing um, front of the hotel and I will be roasting in one of these front chairs very soon after breakfast. Take a moment to appreciate my tan. Right? Right? That's a tan you get when you're out in the sun the entire freaking day. The entire freaking day. That's all we did. We were just by those loungers that I showed you earlier, ordering drinks and fries and dipping in the pool, and it was just incredible. It's about 6 p.m. right now. I don't know where the day went, but we're going to the main town area to walk around. Um, I could use some pasta, pizza, food right now, and we'll watch sunset and look at Mount Etna with sunlight today. Yesterday we hiked up this mountain to get to this really famous restaurant, um, and by the time we went up, it was dark. So while the food was great, the views were subpar because the sun had set, but today hopefully we'll get better pictures at a higher peak. So let's go. wasn't recording oh my God. so we've just been having an amazing time here um, there's this restaurant that Vivek just found it's called Osteria Pizzeria Le Trevi Le Trevi and it's um, an amazing pizza restaurant that sits on the cliff side the cliff side of a mountain so you get to see the beautiful valley view um, the clouds and the sunset and everything the views are amazing they have outdoor seating as well, which is beautiful. So far, we've had so many different things already. And then Vivek was like, you haven't vlogged any of this. And I was like, that's true. I was so busy eating, I forgot to vlog. The wine we got is incredible. Um, it's from Sicily. It's not Mount Etna, but it's from Sicily. And it's actually really, really good. Um, and we've had so far, I've had so far, I'll put pictures up. Um, I've had the octopus carpaccio, amberjack carpaccio. Um, Vivek had an eggplant parm, which was so good. And we had a pasta that we shared, pasta a la Norma. Um, we split that, and it was vegetarian with eggplant as well. So good, so al dente, and our pizza just arrived. Yeah, and what's crazy is how we're eating so much, but it's so light. It's so light, like super light. Yeah, I mean, I just said that. Yeah, that we we ate so much. Oh, and he shaved. Comment below what you think on his shaved look. Oh. Let me show the view. Oh yeah, go ahead. Take it away.
Good morning, friends. Welcome to another day in my life. We are going to take a cable car from Mazaro, which is where we're staying, to Taormina, because that's where Vivek is going to get a rental car. Because we are going on an excursion to, I don't know where, but maybe it'll be easier to explain what the significance is what the significance is anyway so we're going to the place we're going to the place where the cast of white lotus found the dead body that beach that's where we're going forget what it's called kind of shocked right now because I feel like we should be getting more drinks. We've got two Moscow mules, an Aperol spritz, two bottles of water, 27 euros. In New York, that's, that's one drink. That's one drink. 27 euros. I, I, look at this. I thought they made a mistake. Just the, each mule is 8 euros. Our parking spot here is five euros for two hours. I don't know what to say. I feel bad. I think they should be charging more. I definitely was not prepared for this. Should have worn a bikini. Hi guys, we are in the gorgeous town of Cefalu and it is such a vibe here. If you don't want to see American obnoxious tourists and see where the locals come to escape it all, this is the place. Um, the water is so clear here. Everyone's having such a good time. People are just tanning away. We even saw this one lady who was just like completely nude, titties out, living her best life. Um, but let me show you around. I hope you can appreciate here how clear the water is because it is super clear. It's like pool water. I'm kicking myself in the butt for not bringing my bathing suit because I wish I could get in the water right now. friends and family thank you for tuning in we are right now at the last phase of our trip today is literally the last day of our Italy trip tomorrow we're in Paris that's gonna be another vlog but um, so here's what we did we stopped um, at Cefalu because we wanted to check out the beach the beach was gorgeous locals all just tanning and roasting away having the time of their lives. Everyone was Italian, everyone spoke Italian. I did not see obnoxious Americans. Um, and then we drove another hour from Cefalu and ended up, first of all, I don't even know if I'm saying it right. It's spelled C-E-F-A-L-U. So if it's Cefalu or something else, I apologize. But um, we drove another hour and ended up in Palermo. Palermo. Anyway, so we're in Palermo and there is literally nothing here. This place, do not be fooled by White Lotus, this place is a freaking dumpster, okay? Dumpster, until you hit like a nice hotel, which is exactly where we are right now. What, pl what is this place? Hotel Igelia or something? Igelia, Villa Igelia. There's a Bulgari down here. Igea, a Rocco Fort Hotel. So literally had to drive around the town of Palermo, the city of Palermo, which basically looked like a third world country. Um, sure very, serious, very, very, very shocking. 
um, we came close to ZTL areas and even around those areas very third world looking um, so we I had to pee so badly I don't know what it is this trip my bladder has been spastic AF but I had to pee really badly Vivek was like let's find a hotel nearby it's really good so he's like let's find a hotel nearby we found this place I got off peed right away and then we came to the terrace area, which was gorgeous, for some drinks. I had an espresso martini, and I had the freshest scallops with truffle, as well as red raw shrimp carpaccio. It's like the best meal to end my trip here, like seriously. Um, I'm obviously full from all that, so I'm having a watermelon salad right now. There's a wedding happening here. Everybody is old money, rich as fuck here. Like, Vivek and I are the youngest couples here. So, I don't know what's happening. But, like, literally all of Palermo has one nice area, which is this hotel. And maybe some other places, I don't know. But we drove around for quite a bit and just didn't... Fair warning, though, it's not like we did research before coming here. So, like, grain of salt. Yeah. But, essentially, like, we couldn't find anywhere else to go or hop off and until we found this hotel. And we're glad we did. We had, we had a great sunset evening. There's a wedding happening here. We're having drinks. We're having appetizers. Maybe even dessert later on if we're feeling frisky. Um, and then we're heading back. By the time we arrive in Tarmina, it's going to be midnight. And tomorrow morning, our flight to um, Paris is at 10.45. So we're leaving at 7.30 from Catania, from our hotel to Catania. And our next adventure begins. It's just like adventures after adventures. I, I, can't complain. Thank you. Wow. I didn't get the shot. I did. I did. Fucking SD card is initializing. That always happens. Oh my god. What? Wow. They're doing magic tricks? I swear to God, am I, are we at a theme park right now? The Maro connoisseur over here. Alrighty. Got some free dessert. Okay, that's the highlight.